how to reverse clip in iMovie if you are using MacBook Air, MacBook Pro or iMac the steps are going to be same. Now the very first step you have to do is you have to open iMovie which you can find in dock system if you have already downloaded it. If you haven't you can go in app store and download iMovie for free. Once you open iMovie this is the basic page now there are two options one is the project option where you can check out your all ongoing projects and in media section you can find all the imported files which you are using for editing. Now as you can see there is no file so I have uh, I haven't imported any file sets so we'll start by uh, doing all the process let's start with the first process which is we have to create a new project so you have to click on this plus option and then you have to click on this movie option to start your editing process now this is the main workstation now let's take a look at each and every uh, you know basic aspects which you need to know before start your editing now under my media as i told you you know uh, you need to import your uh, audio files or your video files which you can use over here to edit under audio and video section you can find the audio files which you can use on your videos now under titles you can check out all the different types of title transition over here so you can just scroll on it on the top of it and you can see the effect so you can use this titles to add in your videos to make it enhanced under backgrounds you can use all the other backgrounds if you want to and in transition if you are using or if you are working on multiple clips you can add transition on it you can see if i try to scroll on top of it it will show how that effect is going to look so you can add this transition from switching one clip to other so these are the basic things you need to know now let's start with the reverse clip process now let's select my media and first of all i need to import video so select my media and you can click on this down arrow to import a video or photo from your computer select that now my file is on desktop so i'm going to use this car video and running video for example let's select car video if i click on space bar you can check out the video here before importing now you can see the car is moving ahead and the camera is following i want to make this clip in reverse format so select this particular clip and click on import selected now you can see under my media we have successfully imported a video now the next thing you have to do is you have to select this file and you have to click and drag it to this part over here so that we can start editing now let me show you once again you can see the car is moving ahead and the camera is following we are going to reverse this clip now this blue part at the bottom is actually the audio part this video doesn't have any audio which is why it is not showing any waveform over here but if i select that if i want to uh, if there are any audios we can manage the audio level as well now if i want to reverse this clip i'm going to select this clip i'm going to go on this speed option which looks like timer you have to select that and you have to select reverse option and as soon as i select reverse the effect is applied automatically now if i try to play this video once again you can see the car will move backwards now you can see the car is moving backwards where at the start the car was moving forward in this video we have successfully reversed it now let's delete this and let's try importing another file so select my media you can click on this down arrow and then let's try using running video now you can see a guy is running forward and the camera is once again following so we are going to import this file select this file click and drag it over here and once again before reversing the clip you can see the guy is moving forward select the clip once again select the speed option and click on reverse you just have to select reverse option and all the effect will be applied automatically now if i try to play this video once again you can see the guy is moving backwards so these are the simple steps you have to follow to reverse a clip in iMovie now if you want to import this file if you want to export this file if you want to save this file in your computer all you need to do is you can just simply go on the share option on the right hand side top corner select that you can select export file over here and you can then on the next page add a description you can you know give tags you can select the format if you want audio only you can select audio only if you want audio and video both you have to select this if you want to change the resolution you can select from this if you want to change the quality you can select from here and if you want to compress it faster or if you want the beta quality you can select from here and then you can click next option and you can export this video you can save this video in your computer 
So guys, these are the simple steps you need to follow in order to reverse a clip in iMovie. If this video was helpful, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.